so that your sins may be wiped out, that times of refreshing may come from the Lord. And that's absolutely where we are at now with Kelsey. If you've gotten to know her, she's very open about her life and her sin and all the things that she wants to overcome, but she has fought so hard to get to this place. There's been a, a lot of a lot of accountability in her life, too. We're all up in there asking all these questions. How's it going? How's it going? How's it going? And she has fought to get to a place where she can stand before God now and, and have her sins wiped away. And so we're going to have Sarah share, and then Jeanette and Mara, and then we'll give Kelsey a chance to share. Sure. Um, so, um, I'm super proud of you. You're super awesome. Um, you know, like I came up to you a couple of times and asked you, like, hey, like, do you want to come to church? Do you like to do this? Stuff? You're like, no. And then, like, one day, like, then one day she just like randomly comes up to me. And she's like, I remember I was like waiting to go into work, and she opens the door. She's like, hey, do you guys have Wednesday study Bible studies? I'm like Wednesday, Wednesday night Bible studies. I'm like. No, but we do have like personal ones, you know, this and that, and then like from there it just kind of like exploded, and then it led to today, which is super awesome. But um, I just wanted to share this scripture with you. It says, it's in um, Isaiah 41 and verse 10. It says, "So do not fear, for I am with you. Do not be dismayed, for I am your God. I will strengthen you and help you. I will uphold you with my righteous right hand." And I know that this battle has been super, super hard. We've all gone through it, and we're here to support you. But most importantly, you're gonna have God back you up. Mm-hmm. And I promise you that it's it's gonna be hard, but not as hard as you think it's gonna be, because. After you're baptized, you just, and I think, like, we've been talking about it, now you're going to have the Holy Spirit, and you're going to have God's army, and you're going to have, like, an entirely new spiritual family to be behind you, so don't worry about whether it's going to be hard or not, because you have more than the entire world behind you. Come on. Kelsey, I'm Chi-Chi, for those that don't know me. Um... (laughs) Um, <laughs> yeah, Kelsey. I one of the scriptures I shared with her in one of the studies was when Paul was talking to King Agrippa in Acts 26, and I simply told her what Paul preached, and he said, "I preach that they should repent and turn to God and demonstrate their repentance by their deeds." Amen. Um, at one point during the studies, I wasn't sure whether Kelsey liked me or not. Because, <laughs> Um, I was just preaching, girl, you need to prove your repentance by your deeds. If you're really going to change, change it right now. And I took a two-second break to go get something, and then when I came back, she had repented. I was like, well, I didn't even get to see the repentance, but everyone else saw it. Um, but it's just super encouraging because, honestly, at the end of the day, there's so many people that say they have faith but they have no deeds to back it up. And though um, a lot of the things that we tell you were hard teachings, you struggle, you fall. There were times where you were looking at us like you just wanted to get up and take a walk, (laughs) but you didn't. You got up and walked towards repentance. And I'm so proud of you. I even had the privilege to tell your mom that, to see that you've changed so much in such a few days. And it's incredible that you did. You said, you know what? It is a hard teaching, but the Bible says it, and I'm going to obey. So I love you. I'm excited to see how God's going to use you. And yeah, welcome to the battle. shared today too in Matthew 19 26 it says Jesus looked at them and said with man this is impossible with God all things are possible Um, this is something I told you quite a few times during the studies but uh, just through your repentance and that you know we can't do things by ourselves but with God we can do anything and you've really shown that um, just by what everyone's been saying your deeds what you've done to repent is amazing like just getting here was a battle you know but I'm really proud of you I'm really excited to see how God's going to use your testimony to bring other yeah. people to him yeah. um, because you really do have a powerful testimony um, but I'm excited you guys get to know her hear her testimony listen to her um, she's really <laughs> awesome and so I'm excited for you love you a lot Come on. started coming up to me I'm just like I was wasn't like so 
I wasn't wanting to go to it at first, but then I'm just like, well, may as well just see what it's all about. And like the first studies were easy. And then she turned on. She turned on. She, she made him hard. And she's all like, no, you've got to do this. If you don't do this, we're not getting past this point. Like, that's, 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 that's just it. So I'm just like, so, of course, how she says I did, I did it when she went on her break, so. <laughs> but it's taken a lot just to get to this point and everything. And, like, yeah. to say that I can do this today is, like, amazing. So. Yeah. Come on. Come on. Come on. Yeah, I'm just, like, so grateful for everyone. Like, especially the girls that have helped me get to this point here today. So. Yeah. Come on. Come on.